What is up you guys? It's Evan and I'm back with some more Madden 25 Connected Careers. This time I'm just going to show you guys real quick what I'm getting for my guy to upgrade him a little bit. I got some stiff arm, got some juke move in this, and I ended up getting some spin move as well. It was hard to decide because you only get an upgrade of one per each amount of XP that you spend, and I only had like 10,000 XP, so I mean it's going to be hard to level up my guy. It's going to take a couple years, like uh, someone told me that it takes a legitimate amount of time to actually upgrade your guy. It's actually fairly realistic, the upgrading system compared to the upgrading system in NCAA where you can just probably upgrade your guy by four points uh, almost after every single game in, the, in a ridiculous amount of stats, like your stiff arm. You can upgrade it by four probably after one game even, but this game is going to be a long-term situation, sort of like a legitimate NFL career where you don't just become amazingly good out of nowhere. It takes you a large amount of time to actually build up the amount of skill you have, and, this, and the speed upgrade takes about 50,000 XP to build it up by one, so I mean, there's some upgrades that are ridiculous. But getting into the game anyways, we're playing against the Jacksonville Jaguars. They got some new helmets that are pretty cool looking. On the punt return, get a couple yards, but I do eventually get tackled. And then they actually put me in here to block for Marshawn a little bit. Uh, don't really block anybody, but he ends up picking up the first down anyways. They pull him out of the play though, and I do come in for my ru first rush of the game. And I am going to score a touchdown on the nice 10-yard run right there, bring it right into the end zone. Russell Wilson's happy about that. I'm doing some uh, dancing in the end zone again, not looking too cool, but whatever. And then Pete Carroll loves it. Pete Carroll is enjoying my game as well. Doing some more punt returns here again. Still up 7-0. to zero, Still in the first quarter. Going to be taking it from, from the 50-yard line here. Getting around a couple of blockers. And eventually I do run into one of the tacklers for some reason. I thought I was going to be able to get around him, but I do end up getting tackled. They come back and they do end up scoring a touchdown and a field goal. So we're only up by four points in the second quarter here. And I do get tackled out of the end zone at about the 20-yard line. Not that great of a return. That's pretty much all I'm doing in this game is returns like I've been doing in the past until I can get some starting time, hopefully very soon. Right here, I'm going to bring it all the way around to the left side, get some great blocking here, and I bring it all the way to within the 10-yard line inside their red zone. And Pete Carroll is happy about that. Again, giving me the finger wag. My guy's pumped, running back onto the sideline as well because I'm not going to get any more playing time. So we come back after we score another touchdown, and I didn't do a punt return for that uh, set right there. So I am going to be in here. I thought I was pretty wide open, but he gets it to Zach Miller instead, who drives it down to within the five-yard line. Russell Wilson is doing a pretty solid job. He's only got 50 yards and one touchdown, but, uh, you know, that's fine. As long as we're winning the game. Anyways, he's going to throw it out to Marshawn Lynch on the right side, and Marshawn Lynch is going to get his second touchdown of the game. A great job by Marshawn Lynch so far in this game, though. He's got over 150 yards at this point. 28 to 10 at this point. It's looking pretty out of reach for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Did not expect them to put up much of a fight in the first place. Get around a couple defenders right there, and I throw one defender to the ground before I finally get tackled at about the 50-yard line. And once again, Pete Carroll is excited about my punt return game, and I'm nodding off to the fans saying, oh, yeah, I am filthy at punt returns. <laughs> but anyways, another punt return, probably the sixth punt return of the game. And I'm going to take it to the left side, of course. And I get around one of the defenders. I bring it upfield a little bit. Get around a couple more defenders before I get tackled finally by the kicker, actually. If I could have gotten around him, could have returned that for a kick return touchdown. P. Carroll was like, oh, that was pretty nice. So we're going to have to put him in the game a little bit more. Once again, nodding off to the fans again about my great punt return game. Another punt return here in the fourth quarter with about 40 seconds six. left. We're up 42-13 to 13 at this point. No hope for Jacksonville. Yeah, Just getting some yards. And Pete Carroll wasn't too happy about that. He didn't give me the finger wag. But it doesn't matter because we end up winning the game anyways at home. 42-13. to 13. Nice game by us. They're going to interview Marshawn Lynch here instead of me. I did not get much playing time. Got a couple punt returns for a lot of yards. But he ends up getting 28 carries for about 210 yards and three touchdowns. So that was definitely a great game for Marshawn. Hopefully, eventually, I can get some more playing time. I did score one touchdown on about a 15-yard rush, and that is going to end up being the play of the game as well. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. The stats are going to be coming up pretty soon for the teams. And comment, like, subscribe, you guys, and have a nice day.